Hi, welcome to another video by Couches Campers. Today we're looking at a 2011 Montana High Country Model 323RL. I'm going to take a minute and walk you around this camper. These Montana High Countries have the gray fiberglass exterior with the black accent on the awnings and some of the features on it. This unit has power front jacks, has a nice power awning, it has a very large storage compartment. There are TV hookups in this storage compartment. The TV in the bedroom will actually slip off its mount and right onto the mount here in the underbelly. So you can watch TV outside if you'd like. This unit has triple entry step, has aluminum wheels, has a radius entry door at the top so that door won't tear the awning. It has a porch light, it has outdoor speakers, it has black framed deep tent safety glass windows. This unit has power rear jacks, has a molded fiberglass rear cap with a ladder attached to it. it. has reverse lights, so when you're backing up it does light up. You'd be surprised how many campers don't have that. This unit has three slide outs. It is a rear living room model, front bedroom model. Over here we have the dump station located right down here this is where you actually dump at just above that is the 10 gallon gas electric water heater we have just above that the refrigerator vent for maintenance on the refrigerator down just to the left, we have a place for sewer hose, right in here. We have the furnace exhaust. On this side of the storage compartment here, these doors swing open, so you don't have to try and hold it up and fight with it. We have an exterior light, outside shower, water heater bypass, freeze guard system for winterizing, uh, cable and satellite hookups, battery disconnect, we've got the uh, power tank fill, a couple of the dump handles and the low point water drain handles are right here. City water hookups, black tank flush, all located in a nice convenient docking station. This unit is 50 amp service, that's the 50 amp power cord for it. This unit has two 30 pound gas bottles. One located on each side of the coach. Two stage regulator, regulate the pressure. This unit also has the quick pull pins on the jacks, so they drop real easy just by pulling a pin. You'll see here that you've got a nice aerodynamic front end. This is notched out and arranged for short bed trucks. They have max turning technology, which is really nice. A lot of short bed drivers out there. I'll take you inside here, show you around the inside a little bit. We have uh, the eight cubic foot refrigerator. The Mountaineer High Country does uh, two-tone cabinets on some of the stuff in here. We've got the freestanding dinette with the four chairs. Dinette table has the extension on it. Has the nice nightshades to help block out the sun, give you some privacy. Lots of cabinetry in here, very beautiful cabinetry. This is a height -a bed sofa, which actually has a built-in air mattress and also a large drawer on the bottom of it.
has two nice size recliners they swivel and rock and recline has ducted floor heat in the floor and then we have ducted air conditioning in the ceiling it's also wired for second air conditioner has a very nice house ceiling fan inside here this unit has a nice computer desk fireplace AM FM CD DVD stereo uh, Vizio high definition television This unit has the Atwood oven with range top, nice drawers and cabinet space, microwave, on up into the bedroom bathroom area here. This little hallway, you've got your monitor panels and everything right here, nice location in the middle of the coach, air conditioning controls. Fantastic fan controls, ceiling fan light, and then just a hallway light. It does have a nice window here in the hallway as well too, letting in some more natural light. Into the bath area, we've got a glassed-in corner shower. We've got a triple light vanity. It's got a nice Euro-style bathroom sink bowl. Upgraded porcelain foot flush toilet. Has some extra cabinets in this little corner area here. Another nice little thing about these side baths like this, you do get air conditioning and heat in the bathroom. It's kind of nice. A lot of walk-through baths don't have air conditioning or heat in them. This unit is prepped for washer dryer hookup. Has another flat screen TV here in the bedroom. That's the one that goes into the basement if you'd like to put it outside. That TV is actually 12 volt also. So even if you're camping with just battery power, you can still watch the TV at nighttime if you'd like. Washer dryer combo would go inside of here. There's your water hookups and power outlet for it. Another drawer below. Nice size closet, little shoe storage shelf. Also an electric outlet down inside there in case you need to plug something in on this side of the bed. Nice bedroom slide out, queen size bed. This has been another video by Couches Campers. If you'd like, you can visit us on our website, www.couchescampers.com. That's www.couchscampers.com. Thank you for your time.